Hello everyone. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about the solution proposed by us for smart classes. First, we will discuss about the items which required for this setup and then we will discuss about how to do the setup and how to install the product. In this interactive solution setup, what you need is first any display which should have minimum 3 mm of hardness of the surface so that you can get a better writing experience. Second is mini PC that can be Windows 10, Windows 11 along with USB ports. Right now we are using the mini PC which is having 4 USB port and 1 HDMI port. So during setup I will sh show you ki how these ports are important for this. Minimum requirement is USB port, 2 USB port and 1 HDMI port in mini PC with Windows application and RAM should be minimum 4 GB and processing should be uh, i3 minimum. Then you required at least 256 GB SSD or normal hard drive. And third, third one is interactive device which is in the state DG annotate which currently we are using. So this device comes with uh, in, comes in a packaging in this device you will get uh, one uh, interactive device then one uh, writing pen along with this you will get one strip which can be used for mounting due, uh, if you are installing with projector as this device is compatible with projector and TV uh, both and one pen stand you will get, get in the box. One USB cable you will get which will get connected to th this device and your mini PC. So further we will discuss how we will integrate all these three systems and make, make the solution interactive classrooms or smart classroom. So now we are going to do this setup. I have taken this Industech device. This device is normal device you can see we cannot touch this device this is very hard surface 3 mm and more surface we are currently using. So what we will do we will connect first in the stake device one portion in USB mini USB cable and then place this device on the one edge of this display. You can place this device over here over here or even over here also this is not mandatory that you have to place this device over here only. We have placed this device in this side because all the icons of any windows laptop or any windows mini PC comes over here. So this will become very convenient to use. So what I will do now I will connect the USB port to the mini PC. One light you can see will come red light will come over here you can see over there. Now you can see I have taken the pin. This comes along with the industry uh, device, interactive device. The from the upper side, second button we will press on over here. One beep sound will come and crusher will come nine times, which we need to touch with the help of this pen. After 9 time touch, it will uh, repeat the sound and then interactivity is okay. Now we have uh, gone through the interact calibration and now we can use our screen as a touch, touch, touch screen. So here we have opened the board where you can write through selecting the pen. So this way you can use the whiteboard if you want to annotate on any PDF or any pictures what you need to do is you have to just minimize this whiteboard and then open the PDF or presentation whatever you want to use and here you can select the pen 
and use the annotation bar you can erase the annotation also from here you can select and erase the annotation whatever annotation you have done you can erase here right so i am doing this erase function over here and now you can again select the pressure and then close this similar thing you can do with any photograph also so this is the photograph which currently i am using again i have selected the paint and i can annotate i can underline i can highlight it's over here so this is a very good thing which you can use during your classes so here we have done some uh, notation work some writing works on my board so here are the tools i can change the color of my pen from the tools i can erase whatever i am writing over here and similarly i can change the background color from here so we can change background from here you can see the blackboard if i required blackboard i can select from here and i can start writing on that so everything which is required for a teaching is on this whiteboard similarly if you don't want to use whiteboard you can use any board and you can annotate on any documents with the help of this toolbar which will come after opening the open board software if you want to use keyboard on the screen if you don't want to use any external keyboard what to need to you do is you can choose on screen keyboard and one keyboard will come over here and you can type from here whatever you can you want to type so this is all about the setup and using this this smart class solution for whatever we are providing to you so in this video we have already seen how we have done the setup and how to use the whiteboard and this all uh, setup so thank you very much for being with us for more videos please